it's it's kind of depressing. Alan Tate, the co-owner of the French Market Creperie in downtown Knoxville, feels like his landlord is trying to push him out. We're pretty upset about it. It's very stressful. Tate tells me since his landlord decided to redevelop the hotel on top of his restaurant as a Hyatt place, certain renovations, like this giant temporary wall built in front of his store, are hurting his business. He was told by the landlord it's for safety, but as you can see, it ruins the view from the patio. And Tate wasn't told how long it'll be up. We feel we're being intimidated by our landlord to get out. Looking at the commercial lease Tate has with his landlord, Rick Dover, the restaurant is currently in a second five-year lease that expires in 2018. Tate says Dover wants to replace his business with a large franchise. I had a phone call from him today, which basically he said that, yes, they want to put a Starbucks in this location. We reached out to Rick Dover about this. Hello, Rick. This is Brandon Rook with WATE6 on your side. But I was only able to leave a voicemail. Tate just wants to stay where he's at, saying this is more than just a restaurant to a lot of people. This is our second home, you know, and our employees are like family to us, so... You know, we worry about them as well. Tate says the only way they'll leave their location is if Dover compensates them for terminating the lease early. If we could work out something with our landlord that's fair, then we might consider relocating. But he has to make a compensation package that's worth our effort. Now, they have 11 employees working here, and Tate says if they were to close, this will affect lots of those families. Now, once we hear back from the landlord, we'll let you know what he says. Reporting live in downtown Knoxville, I'm Brandon Rook, WATE, 6 on your side. All right, Brandon, thank you so much. Now, Tate also telling us this is the third landlord they've had since opening up in October of 2008.